Picked up. On their way, a perfect start. And no clear leader. And in the center, Crumlin Queen puts the head in front with She's Got Fire at the Y the first time. And taking a nice relaxed position, March of Dreams on the inside. And Reg Cabernet lopes up on the outer. She's the Berries' is back last, shaded by Bear Poor as they turn out the stretch. And with the early lead is Crumlin Queen. It is Crumlin Queen and the classy and smart. A length to Red Cabernet going up to be second. And She's Got Fire on the inside. One away is Bear Poor, second last early on. March of Dreams got back. And She's the Berries will be absolute as they go into the back stretch. Five lengths covers them at best. And racing out in front, getting a bit further ahead now. Crumlin Queen a length and three quarters. Red Cabernet moving up in second. One away third. She's Got Fire on the inside and about three parts of a length to Bear Paw. A couple away, March of Dreams, and She's the Berries is on the outside. They run inside the four and a half furlongs chasing Crumlin Queen. And it is Kazushi Kimura and Crumlin Queen two in front, Rick Cabernet second. She's got fire the inside, Bear Paw is fourth. She's the Berries for the first time showing some interest, is edging up now. And on the inside is March of Dreams as they head to the three eighths. Racing in front, Crumlin Queen, Rick Cabernet striding up easily in second. And on the inside, She's got fire, Bear Paw goes up on the outer. She's the Berry still second last and March of Dreams. They're in pairs as Red Cabernet takes the lead narrowly. Crumlin Queen on the inside. Three wide Bear Paw revved up. She's the Berries trying to make ground the outside. She's got fires. Got the split if good enough in the center. Down the lane. Bear Paw and She's the Berries lugging about a bit of coming. Out in front Red Cabernet. Crumlin Queen sticks on but She's the Berries mowing them down on the outside. She's the Berries and Red Cabernet to the wire. And She's the Berries on the outside. Red Cabernet, I think she's the Berries narrowly from Red Cabernet, a very close photo. Behind them is Bear Poor, and then came March of Dreams and the Classy and Smart. A photo for the win, 144.16. Just like Daddy. And bred by Brereton C. Jones in Ontario. The winning rider is Eureka Rosa da Silva. And that result is... Inside the classy and smart winner circle with Yuriko da Silva and, of course, Catherine Sullivan. Uh, she's the Berries. Uh, she's the winner of this race, and you got the trip you wanted. Uh, you know, it was a little, the, the first turn was a little slow, and, uh, but the pace started picking up. And, um, you know, she's just a nice horse. You just need to let, she loves to wait and uh, make a good run on them. And, and when she run, she run really hard. Does she have a preferred surface? I mean, she races well on the grass and tapita. Uh, you know what, she's a very honest horse, a very nice horse, and she handles any track. She, she can run in the gravel. <laughs> <laughs> the good ones can handle anything. That's back-to-back yeah, yeah. -back wins for you. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm so grateful to work with this team, and, uh, you know, they always do a great job, and good luck to everybody. All right, there it is. Eureka with the win. Catherine, you know, kind of feels somewhat appropriate that uh, she gets one after back-to-back -to -back tough defeats. Yeah, I mean, she tries hard every time. She really is out there running her, her, you know, her eyeballs out, and it was she really deserved this one, I thought. And gallon in defeat was Ian Black's Red Cabernet. I uh, just spoke with Eureka about this. In your opinion, does she have a preferred surface? Uh, I mean, I'm not sure about the gravel, but I think she'll <laughs> run on anything you put her on. I mean, she's just got a lot of heart, and she's just a racehorse. All right, you guys continue to have a great 2019. Uh, congratulations on this victory. Thank you so much. Congratulations to um, Airdrie Stud and everyone there, Mr. Jones. And we just love having these horses. Complete team effort. Catherine Sullivan, assistant trainer with Mark Cassie. Uh, she's the Marys, capturing today's Classy and Smart.